What is the single most impressive performance that you have seen in person from a player? So this eliminates a lot of stuff. I have to have witnessed this in person. This didn't take long for me. Derrick Henry, in 2015, he won the Heisman Trophy. So we all remember that. Do you remember his specific stat lines from any game? He started, I mean, he always carried the ball a lot, but as they got later in the season, they started giving the ball to Derrick Henry more and more. Jake Coker ended up turning into a lead blocker some of their games, and he was the quarterback. So they get to the end of the regular season, and I was at that Iron Bowl down in Auburn. And uh, Auburn, not a great team that year, but yet just like this past year, they pushed Bama. So it's like a one-possession game, I think it was, late in the fourth quarter, and Derrick Henry ends up sealing it. I think we just probably showed you the touchdown if you're watching the uh, individual video here. His stat line, Derrick Henry's, for that game in the Iron Bowl, 46 carries. I just want to pause there and let that sizzle for a moment. 46 carries in a game, 271 yards, one touchdown. I think it was, yeah, 5.9 yards per attempt. So right at six yards per attempt, carried it 46 times. And the reason why I keep emphasizing that, aside from the obvious, a college football player carried it 46 times, is because I remember back in high school when he was setting all these records down at Uli. And everyone kept asking, well, first they were asking, what position is he going to play in college? That's no running back. That's a linebacker. He looks like an alien playing running back. He's a 6'3", 6'4", like 250. That's not a running back. Well, uh, we solved that. We figured that out. It turns out he was pretty good at running back. He could probably do whatever he wanted to. Guy could probably play corner if he wanted to. So Derrick Henry ends up being a running back in college. Well, then you have these questions of durability. Oh, they've run a lot of the tread off his tires in high school. Irresponsible. Wag the finger at the high school coach. So, you know, he'll, he'll probably be damaged goods by the time he gets to Alabama. Nope. So then you get later in the season, and, uh, you know, they had a game, I, I want to say, I can't remember who it was, but he carried it like 38 times. And then they say, you notice how he kind of got stronger as the game went on? And Nick Saban said, yeah, yeah, I noticed that. So then they get into the SEC uh, regular season finale against Auburn, also known as the Iron Bowl. He carries it 46 times. I was on the sideline, and I remember vividly seeing Derrick Henry in person. I had seen him in person a few times. If you've never seen Derrick Henry in person, it's the wildest thing you'll ever see because you're looking at him, well, you're looking up at him, and you, you know that he's a running back the entire time. You're used to seeing defensive ends look like that. Sometimes you'll see that size on an offensive tackle. They'll be a little bit, uh, shall I use this word? Yes, I shall girthier, but Derrick Henry looks like someone dropped him on earth from somewhere else. It doesn't look like he was made here. It looks like he was dropped here. Extremely high hips. He's very, very tall in general. He just doesn't look like anyone else. And so then you're standing on the field and you're watching him and it's just banging away, banging away, banging away. And you're looking at the scoreboard and you realize we're about to roll into the fourth quarter. He's already in like the upper thirties for carries. Who are they going to about to put in? Yeah, they got to spell him, right? Nope. They just kept riding him. And he ends up with 46 carries that afternoon. But my point is, going back to the high school thing and, and in college, everyone kept talking about how he was going to wear down. Not only did he not wear down, he got stronger. I think they ran him over 40 times the next week against Florida. So he ran the ball over 40 times in consecutive weeks. They won the SEC championship the next week. They won this game in Auburn. They ended up winning the national championship. And then the same questions pop up. He goes to the NFL. I remember mock draft after mock draft. Henry's going to be drafted here, but the concern is how much tread is left on the tires after the way Alabama, in some cases, people said irresponsibly used him and put that workload on him. It's just never been an issue. You cannot use your previous data points and things you've learned in history and apply them to this generational freak of an athlete because he doesn't fit any of your molds. He didn't then. He didn't in high school. He doesn't now. Derrick Henry, Iron Bowl 2015, most impressive individual performance I've ever seen. We'll be very interested in the comment section to see what some of you say, because some of you have been around a long time. We got folks who watch the show that are, let me do the math, at least twice as old as me, in some cases a little bit more than that. Well, you guys have been blessed to see some crazy, crazy things in person. I had to limit it to what I've seen, and I saw Derrick Henry in 2015, and I think we'll go quite a while before we see anything else like that.